everybody. Welcome back to another week in my life vlog. My name is Elizabeth if you're new. I make a lot of fashion content and lifestyle content. So if that's your vibe, then definitely subscribe. Today I have a very busy day. I am headed to my nine to five right now. After that, I will be coming home to do some telesales for life insurance. I'm really excited because I just started doing life insurance and helping families. So it's really cool because it's something that I love doing. I love like being passionate about something and sharing that passion with someone else because I know it can help them. So that's exciting to be able to come home and make calls. Um, today's like a dial day so we like really focus on calling families, letting them know that we've received their inquiry about getting some life insurance, protecting their family. So um, that's what I'll be doing after that. And then I'll probably do that till about 8, 8.30. And then I'm gonna work on a YouTube video. And at some point I have to try to do yoga because I haven't, I didn't work out over the weekend and I'm just feeling kind of blah from not working out. Um, so, it's gonna be a busy day. I thought I'd bring you guys along because I've got a lot to do. So I think it would be cool to show you guys how I balance all of my business transactions and businesses that I have because I have like three or four jobs. If you count pet sitting, I have four jobs. It's insane. I don't know how I do it. I barely, I don't even think about it. I just do it. That's the best way to do it. All right, I gotta go to work now. Hey guys. So. It has been a couple of days since I've vlogged and I have no makeup on because last night I did not sleep and I woke up so super tired so I didn't put any on this morning but I still have places I need to go and I wanted to bring you guys with me. So the first place I'm gonna go is Walmart because I actually have to, it's so sunny outside too. I have to pick up some stuff. We're having a little party tomorrow at work. Um, we were supposed to have a little St. Patrick's Day party last month, but because a bunch of us were sick, we canceled it. So I guess you could say tomorrow's kind of like, it's our St. Patty's Day party, but it's also like, we're off on Friday for Good Friday, so I don't know, I feel like it's kind of like an Easter-ish party too. So I'm gonna go pick up some stuff from Walmart for the party. Um, I think I heard a couple of the girls talk about wanting a cheesecake and we don't have very many desserts on the list. So I'm gonna bring um, some cheesecake. I'm gonna go to Walmart and pick up like one of the store-bought ones where they have like the different flavors. Hopefully they have that. If they don't, I think I'll get like, I don't know, maybe I'll make something else. Um, I'll just see when I get there. And then I also need a couple of things, uh, some like skincare stuff, so I'm gonna get that. Got some cute clothes. Of course I have to look at the purses because I have issues. Seeing things, read the line in mid between. Get a light, I gotta speed up. Get home, so we coach out. Need that, pronto. Look like a rave at the condo. Heck of a night in Toronto. She said, boy, you in Morocco. Pearl White mentioned in the top go. Fill up my cup with the pop wall. I off life in the spot though. Running at the visa, really talking to a real life Mona Lisa. Jesus piece is hanging off the fleece. So much going on, it's hard to focus on the features. I got one. Too many, I'm going. Too crazy, and I got. Okay, so I'm home from Walmart and wanted to show you guys what I got really quick. So, we're having our party tomorrow, like I said. So, I got this pink cake, this cookie cake. And it says Happy Easter on it, but you can't see the decorations with the fox. Then I got some 
sprinkle edible cookie dough bites. So I figure my brother and I can share these. I bought a smoothie. This is called Remedy Organics is the name of the brand. Um, this one is Cocoa Essentials. 16 grams of protein. It has almond milk, Peruvian, cacao, dates, ashwagandha, maca, and pre prebiotics. I got Jenny Allen's book, Get Out of Your Head. I read her book, or I'm reading her book. I haven't finished it just yet. Um, her book, Find Your People, and that one's really good. So I, she mentions this book a couple of times in Find Your People, and I think that it sounded good because it just sounds like something I'd need to read that I would get a lot out of. Last from Walmart, I got a clothing item. I got, actually there's two other things. I left one thing downstairs, but I got these really cute shorts. They're by Madden NYC, and I got them in a size 11. Um, because your girl has a big booty. I'm trying to lose some of it because it's just so big that it's hard to find pants, but um, Walmart seems to fit me well, like their bottoms, so. Some stuff from the Dollar Tree, uh, sorry, Dollar General now. This is just a yellow loofah. I get tired of trying to always remember to grab like a wash rag to take into the shower with me, so I bought this so that I don't have to do that every single time I shower. Picked up some makeup wipes because I lost my other ones. I meant to grab these at Walmart, but I forgot, so I had to make another stop because I didn't want to walk back into Walmart. Plus, it was on the other side of the store from where I parked, so I just was like, I'll just stop at the dollar store. And then I picked up some razors. So, got a couple of fun things. Nothing too crazy. And that's pretty much it. I probably won't really vlog the rest of the night because I'm really exhausted, but I wanted to bring you guys along with me to the stores. Um, but I am going to try these really quick. I'm obsessed with cookie dough. Tastes more like cake bites than cookie dough bites, but that's okay. They're still really good. Oh yeah, here's the flowers I got. They're actually, they, they look more red, but they're actually like a fuchsia. They're pretty. Hey guys, good morning. Today is Saturday. I'm just sitting at home right now. I'm about to make some calls for work. And um, yeah, I like to make calls for my bed. It's very comfortable. So I'm going to dial with a smile. Also, I finished my Find Your People book last night by Jenny Allen. And I took the cover off because it kept falling off while I was trying to read it. And I can't stand that about hardback. So I usually just take the cover off. I can put it back on now, but it was really good. I 10 out of 10 recommend this book, especially if you're someone who struggles to basically make new friends. I mean, I think we all kind of do in a way. Um, and some people are like better at it than others as far as making new friends. But I think we all kind of have that insecurity of like, how do I do this? And how do I not feel awkward doing it? Well, the book basically tells you you're going to feel awkward, which I really liked the transparency of that. But, um, yeah, it's really good. So you guys should totally check that book out because it really just helps you navigate the awkwardness of making new friends, um, but also encourages you to keep trying even even though nobody really likes that feeling. And like what types of friends to look for, what type of friend to be, it's really good. So I highly recommend Jenny Allen's book, Find Your People. Um, I'm going to start her book, Get Out of Your Head, next because I have a really hard time with toxic thoughts the last couple of months, which that's what this one is all about. Plus that book just really helped me a lot. Her other book, her newest one. So I'm gonna check out this one. I think this is her, this is the last book she wrote. Um, Find Your People's her newest book though. So if you're into like new reads or you've read any of Jenny Allen's books before but not her newest one, definitely pick this up. I'll link it below so you guys can just order it. Okay, so I did just kind of want to give a little update about the life insurance thing that I've been doing. It's been going pretty well so far. I feel like I've made a couple of calls that have gone really well, and I have been able to help one family out. So I was able to issue a policy to this gentleman. It's really nerve-wracking because to basically invest in my own business, and that is hard when I already have YouTube to invest in, and I'm still not making any money from YouTube, so it's kind of nerve-wracking, and it's a huge risk for me. Um, but thankfully, like, I'm a risk taker, so it's not too 
scary, but also I'm like, I really want to be able to help people. I'm just trying to learn the ropes and just get really comfortable with talking to people and finding out what it is they need. Anyway, it's about four o'clock now. I haven't eaten today, so I'm hurrying up, just putting on a bit of makeup because I have a movie date tonight with my friend Sean. I'm going to see Father Stu and I actually work with Sean. We've never hung out outside of work and we've always wanted to. And she had invited me to see this movie with her tonight and I just was like, oh, for sure, I'd love to see that movie with you. So I just got these sunglasses from Key Australia and I think they're so cute. I have like four new pairs from them. These ones are probably my favorite eye pick. So I didn't show you guys the outfit I wore to the movies. Wearing this tank top from Forever 21. Also my jeans are from Forever 21. My, Maya got these for me though. And then my white platform low top converse. I was gonna wear my high top ones but I wasn't feeling it. <laughs> Que ahora me 